my father was interested is interested in trees and okay yeah so you would have had that interest as a kid yeah okay so you're second generation <laughs> yeah I've, yeah At it's least. probably when you're young, you're claiming trees. <laughs> it was 5.5 .5 hectares and 1.7 hectares. So. so you planted one lot when? In 94 and the other bit in 2001. Ash, beech, lower maple, um, sycamore. Um, how, did, how did you choose the species? Just the biggest mix I could, as I could get, you know, I think okay. that's the some lime there. I don't think the everyone has turned tree lovers overnight, but uh, yeah. I think I think people like like uh, the broadleaf plantation more than it's more accessible, you know. It's it's, sort of it's not it's not planted in squares. At the top part, it's it's a rounded shape, so that was a bit of a compromise too with the the forest service. It looks better, you know. Yeah. More natural line to it. Why have you got such an interest in how, you know, landscape design or how how your forest yeah. looks or how your activities? Why do you think that is? I suppose they treat like a big garden or something. They just yeah. Everyone wants to have their garden looking well. So. I'm more interested in wildlife than in wood production or timber production. So okay. obviously, broadleafs are more of a support more biodiversity than conifers. So. Although in the second plantation, I plant a lot of Scots pine, but they would support a lot of biodiversity as well. So, especially wildlife, the wildlife. Is That's the, big, the main the big motivation. Reason, yeah. And have you noticed the change in oh, wildlife? Oh yeah, Indeed, from the first year you'd notice extra birds. You know more. You can hear the bird song now. See, uh, one that was really was the the jays. Jays. Yeah. yeah. Wow. They came in one of the first third or fourth autumn. The acorns, I think so. And then you'd find you'd find acorns growing in the adjoining fields, then where the jays had planted them, you know. Where you there's no there's no oak around here really, you know. There's one oak tree at the very top. There's only one oak tree the whole in the whole land. And the first couple of years, I did a lot of shaping on the trees. So I suppose I should be doing high pruning in places and, and thinning because uh, it's coming to that stage now that uh, we have to decide what trees. We should let go and the trees we should cut out. Yeah, okay. There isn't room do for more. You, you know, do you feel confident that you could do that yourself or do you think you'd need to get some advice or help? It would be nice to get some advice or help, but uh, it's time, I suppose, is the problem. I have to get to uh, do the work myself, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, so, so quick, yeah. yeah. So, what your impression would have been that they would have grown slower? Mm. I suppose, yeah. You, you'd imagine the you know, oak trees take hundreds of years to grow, and some of them have really, in you know, the 12 years, have really taken off. And uh, I don't know that, whether it's the climate or. Apparently, there's no trials done in this, so I suppose it's, yeah. it's going to be mm. interesting. Um, I won an immunity award in 99 or 2000 for okay. the. For the, for the forest as an amenity, but uh, I've been I've been fighting hard to win the biodiversity award, so uh, it's my next target. Just the little plantation, just right there. So they were very impressed with the growth rates of the oak, and yet when we came in here, um, they asked what what would you like to plant, and uh, it's the same. And he suggested Sitka spruce for for it here, you know. Was it a different forester? Forestry inspector, or no, same, same, same one. Yeah. So I wonder why. What was his reasoning of saying that spruce would do better in here? I don't know. So how did you end up with older if he was saying spruce? Well, it was compromised. I think I wanted oak and he wanted spruce, so you know, halfway. Okay. Well, it was. It seems like a great um, choice for as a pioneer. Yeah. I mean, Sika spruce is also a pioneer. Um, you know, it's it grows in the light. It's a light demander like older. I've never regretted uh, planting at all. I just only wish I had planted earlier. It was really a, it was a great decision to make at the time. And I can't uh, praise the trees enough here and and Cron that have that, uh, started the project. So.